colleagues, uh, this visit uh, is part of an intense diplomatic engagement between our two countries. And its highlight this year was the Prime Minister's historic state visit to the United States in June, uh, which has truly opened a new chapter in our relationship. President Biden's visit to Delhi in September contributed immensely as well to the positive trajectory of our ties. His support was key to ensuring productive outcomes at the G20 summit. The dialogue today will be an opportunity to advance the vision of our respective leaders, building a forward-looking partnership while we construct a shared global agenda. In the 2 plus 2, we will undertake, as we have done before, a comprehensive overview of cross-cutting strategic defense and security ties, technology and supply chain collaborations, and people-to-people -people exchanges. Our meeting takes place even as we make rapid strides in all aspects of our bilateral agenda. Our trade is today in excess of 200 billion U.S. dollars. FDI is rising in both directions. 270,000 Indian students study in the United States, and we have a diaspora of 4.4 million. We are exploring domains such as critical technologies, civil outer space collaboration, and critical minerals, even while consolidating established domains. Raksha Mantriji has highlighted new elements of our defense cooperation, including industry collaboration and innovations. A key focus of our discussions today will be the Indo-Pacific region. As we all know, India and U.S. are key members of the Quad, which is scheduled to meet at a leader's level uh, early next year in India. Similarly, we are also engaged in other plurilateral frameworks which reflect our strategic convergences, such as the IPEF, I2U2, and the recently launched IMEC. In context of the ongoing global developments, I look forward to exchanging views about developments in West Asia, Middle East, uh, and Ukraine, amongst others. Once again, I welcome you, Secretary Blinken and Secretary Austin, uh, and uh, Lord, both of you, for your friendship and for your support for our ties.